and welcome back to Yetse Adventures. My name is Yetse, and here we are at the start, clearly. This is the Coral Cove treasure hunt map created by N. Hayes. Is that right? Yes. <laughs> okay, so new map here. And... Uh, once again, found this at planetminecraft.com. Of course, I'll have a link to the map in the description of the video. You can check that out. And I chose it for several reasons. The first, because it is, um, it looks awesome. That's uh, that's one of the main reasons, of course. And then the second is, you see that thing over there? Oh, actually, I'm using uh, Optify. I'm, I'm hoping it will help with my with the uh, look of the video and loading things. I'm just kind of trying it out here. But uh, I'm going to use this uh, zoom function. There we go. You see that little X there? There are 50 of these things. He calls them small ruin locations each containing complete, unique loot. I'm reading from the um, map page, including several sets of enchanted armor, tools, and weapons, as well as enchanting tables and other helpful rewards. So there are 50 throughout the whole island. He has um, just like three people who found all 50 and have, uh, I guess, proved it, proved that they found them legitimately. Um, and so I'm going to try and find as many as I can while exploring the island. And, um, uh, I guess in order to say that I found it, I'm going to try and get as close as I can to it. Preferably go up and hit that little bullseye right there. Punch it. Um, okay, so, ooh. <gasps> oh, oh man! I really thought that was gonna be uh, just like some some free armor or something. Okay, well this will do too. Um, that would have been great. Okay, you know I could have just done that. Duh. Um, all right. Let's. I don't know. Um. I don't think I want that. I don't think I want this either. Let's see. Oh. Oh, cool. Oh, awesome. Uh, let's see here. Whoop, nope, that did not help. Treasure hunting map. Oh, there we go. Oh, okay, so this is basically uh, map description here. Awesome, the ruins are scattered across the map. Marked by the two flames. Were there flames somewhere? Buried in the center of the furnace. Okay. Okay, so we can break any blocks. Um, okay, uh, I'm on normal difficulty. As you can see there. Oh, also... Uh, I'll show you this in a minute. Let's see. The flames are to keep track of your finds. You can optionally be used to create a shrine. Find all the ruins are even close. Ooh. Oh, man. Huh. Oh, okay, cool. And a rating system. All right, well, that's pretty neat. Okay, yeah, so I definitely want to... I'll just store these in here. Here's what I'm going to do. Let's go up to this thing. Oh, the other thing I was going to say is I can't use um, cheat commands. Those are not allowed. So just sure. Uh, I, it's been a while si Oh, my gosh, that looks amazing. Uh, it's been a while since I've played some Minecraft... Uh, so a lot's happened, and so I just, I guess that's uh, one thing you have to do now with these videos is, I guess, prove that you're you're not cheating or, or that you don't even have the capacity 
to cheat. That's about as much as I know right there. Um, I don't have, uh, other than uh, Optifine, which took me a while to install and took me about 30 minutes of going through all the settings, um, I don't have too much knowledge with any sort of mods or anything like that. So, um, okay, we have something. Oh, oh, yeah, that's nice. Awesome. Bam. Wait. Bam. There we go. So there's one. Awesome. Here's what I'm going to do. Uh, I'm going to cut the video, and we are going to, or I'm going to, rather, um, just collect some wood and get some resources here, just kind of get ready to go, just in this general area, probably just down there. And I'll come right back up here, and we will start the adventure. So, I'm looking forward to it, and here we go. And welcome back. Okay, so I have just the bare essentials here. And, except, actually, bare essentials except food. I have no food. So, it is still night. I've decided to move out anyway. Um, okay, going to avoid that guy up there. Uh, but let's go ahead. Can these give me food? I don't think so. But I'm just going to get them anyway. And kind of make my way over to... Oh, actually, you know what? I just thought of an... Oh, food. Yeah. All right. Okay. I just thought of an excellent way to uh, prove that I... I think, I think this is a pretty legit proof, uh, but a good way to prove that I've found all of the... Um, what are they called? The ruin locations that I found. And that is, instead of just punching that metal block, I'm going to take it. There we go. So, we'll put that guy just right down and move all that stuff over. Okay. Melons. Good. I'm glad I found that. That way, it'll be easy for me to see, aha, that one is missing the centerpiece. I've already been there. And I can count the, the stone pieces that I have and keep up with... Um, yeesh. Keep up with the number of... Oh! Ruins that I've found. Okay. Well, that hurt. <laughs> Okay, moon is setting over there. Ooh, zombies. Pack of wild zombies. This is nice. Ooh, piggy. Oh, but the... Ooh. I don't want to do that, because he'll fall. All right, I see some more melons, so I feel like there are melon patches around here. Like that guy. Where was it? There it is. Right down there. So... Perhaps, oh, they're running for cover. Perhaps there's some all over the place to check this out. Bam. <laughs> oh, oh, you're just chilling there. All right, come here. Yeah. Boom. Yikes. Whoa. I got a little weird. Okay. Take care of this guy. Okay, awesome. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Get away, get away, get away, get away. There he is. Alrighty.
the problem with growing food on an adventure map like this is obviously I'm going to be the oh man oh awesome that's great um yeah I'm I'll be continually moving so there's number two so I can't I guess I could make a melon farm oh hello could make a melon farm but um, I would have to keep coming back to it and I don't really want to do that all right I hope the uh, the mix between everything is okay it's been a while since I've done one of these episodes and I hope everything sounds all right I know it's not uh, that great to begin with but I will accept not terrible quality as long as it's not terrible I'm okay let's go on down here that's what I thought might happen as close as we can get. Alrighty. Number three. Boop. What we got? Huh. Okay. I don't really know what that means. Knock back on a fishing rod. Interesting. Mushroom. Hello. Hello. Uh, part of me wants to... Man, this is... This is really high. Oh, coal. Could use that. This is really high. Dead gum. I uh, I have raised the cloud height in Optifine. Oh, wow, yeah. Man, I am really high up there. Goodness gracious. But yeah, so the clouds are higher. Uh, when I first started this, they were about right there, so... Which uh, was definitely going to get annoying, so I'm glad Optifine has that setting where you can change the cloud height. It's very useful. Uh, let's see, let's explore over here. What's up, dude? Check that out. Yeah. Grab that coal. I don't know what sort of rules he's made for as far as where he can place these. So like if underwater is out of bounds or if just burying them in the dirt, if that's allowed. Seems like, I don't think that'd be something he'd do. I don't, I don't know. Yeah. I don't think it's in there. I'll exhaust uh, all the other areas first. Um, so, let's see here. How do I want to attack this? Perhaps my best bet is... Ah, here we go. It's to actually, instead of worrying about going around the perimeter of the island and then going in, perhaps I should go... Um, treat it like stories. So stay up pretty high and go everywhere that I can that's up really high and then go down a little lower. So I'll mess around. Oh, excellent. Getting some good stuff here. So that is number four. Awesome. Oh, I'll have to go back and get the uh, rating system. See how uh, I uh, see how I'm doing. I mean, obviously, I'm only on four, but just for future episodes. <laughs> Let's 
So yeah, I'm gonna head back up here and try to stay up pretty high. Don't think I passed one. Just double back a little bit and check. However, all of this jumping around is not good for my hunger. Oh, excellent. Just in time. There we go. All right. Okay. So I was right there. And I think, yeah, I was on top of there, so. Good to go now. Yeah. Hello, black sheep. Oops. Did not mean to do that. That's okay. There's some more. Great. Chicken. Thank you for your meat. And cow. There we go. Thank you. I like the the trees there. That's cool. Do do do. Whoa. All right. Let's stay on higher ground. By Stevie Wonder. Up oh, here we go. Is number five. Excellent. Uh, it almost feels like I'm finding these in order, which is pretty cool. Well done in Haze. You've placed these in a pretty logical pattern, or perhaps perhaps I'm just uh, searching in a predictable manner. I guess that's both are true. Now this type of stuff, oh wait a minute, now things like this make me a little suspicious. Simply because, well, <laughs> that just looked like a very conspicuous piece of gravel. But obviously, I was mistaken. That's okay, though. <laughs> oh, excuse me. Hmm. <laughs> What's that down there? Caves or something? I don't think that's part of the map, technically. I don't know. Um. Oops. Yeah, this is the stuff right here. That's very cool. Get some coal. Oh, okay. Should have seen that coming. Oh, come on. Oh, shit. Ah. Water is so frustrating this game. Alright, um, here. Alright, that's good enough. I have to clean out my inventory before next episode. Woo! Yeah, more food, excellent. I think I will have to start planting some watermelons or are these 
melons, just melons. Watermelons, that's the same thing, whatever. Um, I think I will have to start planting some. Because I'm finding a lot of these and not very many uh, ruins. Man, I have no idea how big this map is. <laughs> hey, little kitty cat, too. That looks weird. That's one thing that I'm not too happy about in the changes in the latest versions of Minecraft. I don't like that I have to worry about server stuff in a single player video, but that's what they want to do, so it's not too bad. It's not as bad as I make it out to be. <laughs> um, let's see. I don't have a bed yet. We'll continue exploring. I've turned up the brightness. I know YouTube seems to make videos a little bit darker than they were when I worked on them. Um, and I don't, actually, I don't know if that's... I think it's YouTube. It might... Oh! Oh, careful! Little kitten? That is a kitten, is it? it looks like one. Um, anyway, I don't know if that's the editing program that I'm using, which it might be, um, uh, but it also might be how I'm uploading them, which is actually through the same program, so maybe it's doing it. Or it might just be YouTube. Ooh. You have a hat. Ow. There we go. No hat. Fine. There's one. Um, let's check up here. Hmm. Also, also this uh, this this adventure map does not have a uh, top-down map that I can use like I did with Eldaria. Oh boy, this is not good. Um, that was very helpful. Everybody's asking for coordinates, um, but I didn't use any sort of coordinates or anything like that. I Let's see. All right, I think that's the beginning. Uh, I just used the map, um, the actual map map. <laughs> that comes with the, the world save. Um, that was extremely helpful. This does not have one, uh, so this will be a little bit different for me. I'll have to rely more on just, I guess, uh, here we go. Pro I guess proper planning and just keeping up with where I am and my sense of direction, which hopefully won't be too bad. All right, number six, what do we got? Iron helmet. Excellent. So, oh, it's iron. Respiration. Cool. Uh, and actually, I hope this isn't... Oh, it doesn't work. Okay. Man, that would have been cool. I was going to say, I hope that isn't considered cheating, but... Oh, I did not mean to do that. That scared me. <laughs> Woo! That is a big waterfall. That's cool. Man, does that go all the way down to the the sea floor? It looks like it does. Goodness gracious. That is cool. All right. Um I think I'm going to continue to go to stay top side here. until I get kind of a lay of the land and, and just see how big this this island really is. Um, I'm trying to keep the edge of the island to my right and just go around it like that and see how big it is. 
because now I'm, I'm actually starting to doubt my original idea of doing it kind of level by level. Perhaps switching to just like a whole, like a chunk, chunk by chunk. And we'll have to see which is the most effective. Um, okay, let's... Uh, I think I might just pillar up there to get that one. I feel very good that I found or that he's included all of these uh, all these melon patches throughout. That's very cool. All right, I think this will be the uh, the last one for today. safe. Alright, let's see what we got. So, number seven, and ooh, enchantment table, that's pretty cool. Um, <laughs> well, okay, now there, there's tons of woods, sorry, <laughs> tons of wood and a lot of reeds scattered throughout the island. Uh, and I already have some right there. So or sugar cane, sorry, whatever. Um so that means I can create bookshelves and use them to enchant things. So that's good. Alright. I think I'm gonna call it here for the first episode. I'm very excited about this map. Uh, and looking forward to go through here. Uh seven and one one episode's pretty good. I have a feeling I'll average something like that per episode, and then after a while it will just slow to a very tedious halt. Um, that looks like a... is that a village? Yeah, village zombie. It's got that nose, that nose. Um, so it might slow down a little bit, and uh, I might have to do some editing and just show highlights of me finding them. I Oh, it doesn't get that slow. Wait, does this... No, okay. I was thinking the axe might yield more watermelons, but... Or melons. Um, but I don't think it does. Okay, that's gonna be it. Thanks for watching, and stay tuned for the next episode.